Alright, I... Oh, prepared for my... Just finished prepared for my quiz in math today. I have physics in a bit. Uh, two things. Um, one, though my butt still hurts, it does feel significantly better than other times. So I definitely think... I need to make the effort to do those workouts, and then two, <laughs> I watching some of the videos from oh, uh, as these the videos for last week, I realized I'm out of sh out of shape. <laughs> Liz, need, Liz need to how hard I pant. <laughs> After just doing a little bit of jogging and running, and we were like playing tag and stuff. Uh, man, not normally normally the case, or I guess normal for college, but yeah, I'm completely out of shape. It's, it's pretty funny. Uh, but <sighs> I'm also kind of tired because it. I did wake up earlier because of my butt, but I didn't wake up any time in the middle of the night, so that was good. Uh, yeah. I just got my booster for COVID, half an hour drive, uh, and today's going to be a late night because I still have math homework and physics, but uh, oh, it is like 7.30 now, I need to go shopping, I need to eat food, and... I, well, those are the two main things. I love my under, my inner glow. It looks so sick. Well, this is unfortunate. I, I missed dinner because I had to go do the thing and they still were selling the City Hawkins tickets and they just completely sold out. Uh, 
it completely sold out today. So maybe someone got extra. So that'd be cool. As expected, it's been a late night and it's midnight now, but I was not able to get. I don't understand math. I'm, math. I'm going to have to math. So I'm going to have to stop by Corbin's office hours today. And then I didn't get to start physics. But I was able to apply to a uh, an internship. So that's cool. All right, good news. My butt is not hurting like at all today, right now. So that's really good. I'm not sure if it's the medicine, uh, the exercises, or that I took out my shot yesterday, but I'm not complaining. And then we're currently uh, doing our soldering certification for engineering. We probably could have clipped the, uh, the, what's it called, off the, the insulation off the wires to give ourselves some more room to work. With. Yeah, you could have. We could I have done that. More room to work. Okay. All right, Josh. If you want to say you're better than me, just say it. Talk. I just don't work at all. David, you're doing good about not la staying there for a long time. That's good. All right. Physics lab went went decent. Uh, David and I were wrapping that up, but I'm heading to Professor Corbin's office hours. I'll see if I can understand the math. Man, I definitely need to take advantage of that more often. Uh, being like he was really helpful and like maybe I just do that if I ever have a question or I've studied for the quiz and I'm not quite sure if I understand it that should definitely be my go-to all right I just worked on physics and I actually got a question right for once without having to look up the answer and it feels good Not much. All right, I realize I actually haven't done any recordings for my piano practice recently. 
Uh, the main things I've been focusing on are um, all my uh, uh, contemporary pieces, uh, trying to get those back to like good performance level, memorized and stuff. And so far, I got Never Surrender. That one's I've had for a while, and now I, I'm pretty sure I got most of uh, for Beethoven done today. My hands are really sore, but I think I'm still going to play it. It should be a good <laughs> lengthy video, but it should sound good. And then later I might, if I remember, I'll record it. But I've also been just messing around with writing songs and stuff. And what's actually been pretty fun is finding poems or lyrical songs and just pulling up the lyrics and then singing those but making up whatever the melody is in the backgrounds with piano. So that's also something cool. But yeah, I'll I'll play what I what I can for memorize just to have a proof of Hey, I have this memorized at this point in time. Hopefully I don't. I'm pretty sure I have it mostly memorized. But this is a deciding factor.
right, I don't know how well that audio came through, but I I was able to play through. I was able, <laughs> but I don't have it completely memorized. I mean, I do have it completely memorized, but I don't have it memorized at performance level, but that's definitely going to make this video longer than normal. 11 minute video clip and done. All right, good news. I was able, Julie was able to get me a ticket and ah, uh, so the ticket, the ticket for the Sadie Hawkins dance. So that's great. I am able to go. It's on a boat, which should be cool. And now I'll actually be able to teach people slow dance for the swing dance this week and actually be able to then maybe do that also uh, the Saturday. So that should be good. You got this, David. You're on the vlog. Do a further vlog. Look at that muscle. No. <laughs> I feel bad now. No, no, no. That's a lot. Keep going. You got this. You got this. I'll zoom in. Woo. Woo. Oh, come on. You got this, David. Come on. Come on. Nice. <laughs> 40 pounds. Making it look easy. I got to put the There we go, Zave. Nice. Go. Good form. That's what we're talking about. Nice. All right, today's been a pretty good day. I got a decent amount of work in. We'll see what my workload is like tomorrow, but we have a, a mid-semester break Friday, so that should be good. Um, I could take advantage of that and go like surfing well, I, I could not take advantage of it and go surfing, or, but then I'd still be, then I'd still be stressed about homework. Or I could just take a relaxed day, watch a movie, and get some homework done. And I think that is what I'm going to end up doing. Working out was fun. I have physical therapy scheduled for tomorrow, though they were supposed to send me an email telling me the location and the paperwork I had to fill out beforehand. But, don't, I haven't gotten that email yet, so I'll have to call them tomorrow. And then I said I got tickets for the homecoming, I mean for the Sadie Hawkins dance on the boats. I'm really excited. And right now I plan on taking Caitlin and Julia in the in a car and anyone else who wants a ride but what I was thinking is I'm just waiting for a response but I really hope Andrew Sir Killinger can come down because he was saying that he'd be up for just driving down a weekend and hanging out if like a notice was given and if there was ever a weekend to come down it would be next week because Friday there's an awesome jazz concert then he could chop wood with me Saturday morning. Then he could hang out with me or Stuart or David or chill while we do homework uh, throughout throughout the day. And then 
there's the concert choir concert at five and then right after that is the dance and if I can get another ticket for him which I think I actually could now uh, I'm not sure if he's allowed to go per se but he looks like a college student he has a ticket and they didn't ask for IDs last time but Yeah. We could say he forgot his, or we could just be honest and be like, hey, he's a good friend. He doesn't go here, but he's got a ticket. So. I don't know, but I'm just waiting for him to respond because even though it's somewhat short notice, I think that would be awesome for him. Oh, and then he could stay the night again and then go to church with either me or Stuart in the morning and then head back. I think that would be a ton of fun. I really hope he can come. But, ugh. Studying for physics. There's also, also there's physics test Tuesday, which is kind of stressful because rarely can I get the right answer the first time on these questions. And a good chunk of them, I can't get the answer at all without looking it up. So, definitely got to practice. But it's midnight now. So now I'm finally starting to get tired. Uh, David's getting taking a shower, and he'll be ready to go to bed. All right. So we just got back from a project meeting for our engineering design group for the laundry product, and well. We just ran a matrix to see uh, to see which of our top three designs we were going to choose, and it really was in between two. Um, and the one I wanted to do that was significantly harder. Um, was not what end up was end up being chosen because by the product matrix uh, feasibility or how easy it would be to make something was one of the criteria and they it was like a multiplication chart where it was like what you set it at out of 10 it's important and then multiplied by your score about of one through three on what you think how easy it would be so uh, yeah, the design we weren't going to choose, actually, let me switch. So, this was our priority, and then that was our first design, and I got to score 101, and then the design I wanted to do was 111, and then the sky, uh, the design they ended up, uh, that I think, uh, that we end up are going to be doing is 139, and... I'm a bit, I, I, I want, I had want to figure out how to do a queuing system, because that's what the second design had, where, and it had, the second design had an LCD screen and some button inputs for, uh, for the display type, but uh, the one we ended up doing is like a loading bar system where it's just LEDs, and I mean it's cost effective. That's another thing, but I still want to figure out how to do the second design. All right, just got done with physical therapy, and. Uh, just went through the exercises, didn't really learn anything new other than reaffirming that yes, I need to make time for more exercises and we developed the plan where like I would set like, I already know my schedule where I'm normally studying, but I'll set an alarm for certain times uh, during the day to be like, hey, you need to go work out now. 
uh, not work out, you need to go do pull-ups or you need to go do squats. Uh, squats was something that they said would help me back there. And yeah, it was good. And it's a nice day. I've never actually driven, other than when I've gone surfing or uh, came here back from home, uh, never had driven around like this 2, 3 a.m., 3 p.m. hour slot and it's nice and sunny. I want to drive back uh, and then try to get as far into engineering as we can and then D&D. I haven't prepped anything for that yet but I need to look ahead at what we're planning on doing uh, and then I think we'll do EHS games tonight. So it's going to be a late night but we're going to sleep in Friday. Move forward for three. Now for here, we're in prominent position. We're gonna stay in prominent position for one, and then I'm gonna move around her going into this open position for two and three. So at this point, we're going to Yes, it is. Hi. Oh, wait, someone's on the phone. Oh my gosh, is this a vlog? Yes. Hey, vlog, it's Eden. Today, we are playing freeze tag in EHS. <laughs> I think with this many, two. That was really good. Like that, that's kind of the strat. We did well together because I can sprint. Emily, I'm so glad I saw you right there. I decided to go like, shoot, shoot, go, 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 go. Elevator. The elevator, because I was like, that's like, maybe I have a chance, but it didn't go fast enough. <laughs> <laughs> so frustrated. Yeah. Because it was just me and one other person. Right. Just got back from EHS games. Uh, <coughs> it is currently two in the morning, and as per usual with these games, I make it to the last six people or so, and then kill everyone off. I mean, sorry, uh, make it the last six people or so, and then people think I've been killing people, and they vote me off, and I, whether I try to be super suspicious, or I just pl try to be what normally people do, um, <coughs> but, yeah, it was still really fun gonna watch maybe a video read oh, and then I ate some two bowls of fruit loops and milk because I need to gain weight because I was 145 pounds before coming here and everyone said you're going to gain your freshman 15 and I'm like no I'm not so I guess I've oh I haven't been restricting eating but I haven't I don't know but I lost actually nine pounds so Yeah. <laughs> yep, got my exercise in. I'm pretty tired actually, so I'll finish the video, read the Bible verse, and then go to bed. And remember to turn off my alarm so I get to sleep in tomorrow. Alright, I uh, got to bed at like 1. I was, woke up because of my butt at 9, but then, <laughs> then took a shower and then was still tired and then went back to bed. And slept and until 11 and 12. Uh, and it's a really nice day. David's actually uh, studying on the quad. I'm going to go eat lunch. But plan is to uh, mostly just chill, not put too much pressure on myself, but get homework done. 
the homework being studying for physics, engineering, and uh, and also prepping for the swing dance when we're teaching tomorrow, uh, Mark and I. And then maybe watch a movie tonight. I'll have to text Haven to see if he's interested. All right. All right, I am heading out to the auditorium right now so I could practice practice uh, what I'm going to teach with Mark, and it's a really nice day. Might get a video of it. I'm not sure, but that's a really nice day out. Started now. Oh, that's why it's going to the right. Why don't we just subtract here? Wait, 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 wait. Three, two, one. <laughs> that's sick. <laughs> this is... What okay. is that? <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm not touching any bare wire, right? No, I know. It doesn't look like it. Let's see. Right. You're so tall. Okay, here we go. Hey, that's chill. Oh, no. That, that turns. <laughs> Stop turning. Pull it up, yeah. Oh, that's actually way more anti climactic That's three. Oh, that's not even as fast as a little tiny motor. No. Yeah. Yeah, so it's designed think, to I not kill you. I think there's a limiter for... It's like gears on there. There's definitely a limiter for, like, how fast it spins. Let's take your food. Let's cannibalize it a little bit. Take part. What makes it now it see how well it, it, uh, it handles drywall. <laughs> 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 Well, uh, you know what's more fun though? Putting the actual fan blade that is meant for on here. <laughs> David just almost finished his scholarship essay uh, and I missed dinner. So I asked him if he wanted to come get dinner with me and originally it was Wendy's but there was a really long line so I went to Taco Bell instead and I've never had a Baja Blast before but that is one of my favorite drinks now I really like it and it was good because this was the first time you actually saw my inner glow underglow but inner inside so inner glow but yeah that was really cool gonna eat this do some finished physics and then maybe do some engineering if not then uh, most likely just plan on phys finishing physics but then once that is done and I do engineering then we watch the movie and it's time to go to bed let's pray they do not and you will be dead if they do that will leave the palace vulnerable <laughs> Fun movie. All right, chopped wood today. It was good when my friend Meyer got drinks. Uh, I need to, next time I go get more food in my car so I can give it to homeless people who are on the side of the road. I saw someone and gave them all my granola bars, but I need to get some more. Ugh. All right, currently got the ice pack on my butt, but um, just got back from Two hours of working on a math project for Diffy Q. Uh, we had 
we each chose three foods, and we created a, just and then got the food labor f label for them, and we had to create a, we're creating a matrix uh, to try to calculate what proportion of all those foods would be the best for a daily diet, and our. And then we had to we had to guess and check pretty much what the serving size, the best serving size would be, and it was it was it was frustrating because it was really as soon as you increase one thing you decrease something else or increase something else, but in the end we were actually able to get we were able to get we weren't we were we didn't overeat. Um, and we were just, we were, uh, down 15, uh, under 15% on three categories, but everything else we were good. And for how long it took, that was the best we could get. And that was pretty good. Uh, but, uh, there'll be a video for that next week, uh, for our presentation. All right, just got back from church, or I've been back from church. Uh, we had a, not a not a buffet. What's it called when you normally eat food afterward? What are those called? Uh, is my hair really sticking up? That. Okay. Well, then got back and I was tired and I took a 45 minute nap, which felt good. And then working on engineering right now. Just did a really nice commented code for this little voltage thing where you it increases based on temperature and then you have a readout here that gives you the sensor value, the volts, there's degrees in Celsius and degrees in Fahrenheit. So if I raises up and starts moving up and you can see it's now 25 degrees. 26 degrees is the marker above 26. Oh, but I don't know if I'll get it that high. Now I'm going to do some maybe a bit more engineering and I've got more physics problems I want to study and then finish the seal. <clears throat> All right, got some physics studying in and then did a, a smaller hour and a half D&D &D session, uh, which was pretty fun, and getting ready to bed now, I'm just going to watch a bit of video, watch Bible, I'm going to read Bible and go to bed, and yeah, last night. I was listening to the podcast and I was like, I was listening to the podcast and I fell asleep within seven to ten minutes. It's like I've never like been able to record like how fast I've fallen asleep before, but looking back to the podcast, I only remembered the first seven minutes of the podcast, which was kind of funny. So then I had to re-listen to it today, but day was good. My butt didn't hurt that much. I did my 10 minutes of running upstairs and uh, this upcoming week is going to be really busy.